Yo, what's up? Enjoy the video, you guys. We have possibly two feet or more of snow coming by the end of Wednesday. It's just beginning. Hey, good early afternoon, everybody. It is March 19th, 2023 in Big Bear, California, and uh, it's starting to snow. And just really quickly for those of you who were wondering, that's our doggy who's missing right now in the East LA area in Whittier off of like Broadway and Kalina. That was the last place he was seen. His name's Theo. We miss you, little dude. All right, guys. So, yeah, we've, we've got a big storm coming here. This part of the storm, this is just a little taste of what to expect soon. So, this should end in a couple hours, and then we'll have a little bit of a break. We, we could have some on and off snow showers throughout the rest of the day. But once tomorrow afternoon hits, um, these on and off snow showers, tomorrow afternoon, and especially late night, will become a steady snow. And it's gonna be great. Our town needs it. The business owners need this. So I'm, I'm really happy to see it. Right now, my car says it's 40 degrees, but I just got it started, so I know it's not quite that, that warm. And it's 12.37 p.m. in the Big Bear area. Fox Farm Run. This is going to be a short little video to let you guys know that it it has begun to snow. So early this morning, where I live, for, for maybe a minute and a half, because I was up, I've been crying and worried about our dog all night. Um, I fell asleep, but I woke up early. And about 20 minutes after I, I woke up at about 7.15, 7.30, I noticed a snowflake outside. So as I was getting my strength and my will to just continue to do what I have to do in life, because um, I know Theo wouldn't, wouldn't, wouldn't want me just miserable because he knows we are going to find him. But anyway, I saw a couple snowflakes. And by the time I got ready to go out, it was over. So that's unfortunate. Otherwise we would have recorded this earlier. Sorry about that, you guys. I'm telling you, we, we have some really wonderful people up here. We really do. Some really special people who are selfless, so loving and caring. We just want to help. And there have been so many of you. It's amazing the response I got posting that community post about our dog. You guys are you guys are incredible you guys had me in tears numerous times last night just to see the humanity just to see how much you guys actually care it was very special I mean like I expect that type of stuff from you guys because I've been with you guys for years and years but it's 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 just utterly amazing to me how incredibly loving just incredibly loving you guys really are and I just want to say thank you from the bottom of my heart I know my wife is very 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 thankful she should be back home already but obviously our dog is lost in the East LA area um, in the Whittier area as I said off of Broadway I, th I think is, is, is the street Broadway and Kalima 
was where he was last seen yesterday, probably about 6 o'clock p.m. And we've been posting stuff everywhere to find our baby. And the reason why he's lost out there is because my uh, wife, our daughter lives out there. And she took the dogs down to go stay with her daughter because we're going to stay at a hotel up here for a, a few nights and thought it, it, it would be really nice to have our first really romantic time in a long time without any any interruptions like having to get up go walk the walk the dogs and stuff so just a, a, a nice little well-deserved break and then this happened so sorry again you guys and thank you guys for all the love okay so we're gonna head into kind of middle moon ridge area right here this is vine that we just turned on and now we're turning on lucerne so we were on McAllister, turned left on vine and then an immediate right on lucerne this is it, kind of a shortcut to take you into the the upper moon ridge area instead of having to drive all the way around to moon ridge road and come back save some time tell over there on that side of Moon Ridge it looks like we're getting a little bit of snowy snow snow so we're gonna try to hit that up real quickly I've been getting frequent frequent requests a certain area up off of Lassen so we're gonna hit up Lassen because that's gonna be part of the drive anyway but I just I, I just want to remind myself and, and and you guys once again please please understand I'm, I'm not trying to forget anybody intentionally I really am doing the best I can okay we're on Moon Ridge Road now Day. always liked Bear Mountain for another reason also because you have to drive through a nice little neighborhood to get there if you didn't know you're just driving through a neighborhood down these streets and then all of a sudden a big ski resort just pops out of nowhere it's really cool like that over there all right here's Lassen you guys so pretty over there though my gosh all those people having fun skiing and snowboarding we love seeing that oh yeah so on the way down we'll be focused on the mountain on the way up we're gonna check out this side
falls. It's so great. guys no we're not we're just gonna back up back up back up because it's me n-a-t-e and me good morning to the g all right get a nice view of the beautiful ski resort hopefully we don't run into any cars behind us i don't see anybody look at that Look at that, look at all these people. So yeah, I want you guys to see how nice this car is. Just real quickly. Yeah, that's my cross track. The thing is gorgeous. seeing this I love seeing these people having a blast a good beginners area right here you guys it really is a great 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 spot for you beginners Let's zoom in a bit This is a street called Primrose right here. So we're on Lassen and Primrose. I think someone's house is this house on the corner here. I think so. Not much digging you're gonna have to do at all. Nothing for the most part. Awesome, awesome, awesome. There's no one, there's no one back of us here. Oh, it's so fantastic. It is so great, you guys. That brings joy into my heart. That brings joy, seeing all those people having a good time with their families like that. That's what it's all about up here. It really is. That is what it's all about.
and so since we are over here, we might as well just go down this this street real quick called Gold Mine. Well, it's Moon Ridge, and now it's Gold Mine as we make this turn. And then at the end of this little street, it dead ends into Moon Ridge again. Or sorry, Club View. Jeez, pardon me. Now here is the resort. There's no one back of us right now. We can get a nice little slow drive by. Still getting some snow flurries right now. look out there it's snowing out there it looks like a silhouette of the mountains right in front of us that's because it's snowing over there and we're still getting some snow flurries here's our beautiful zoo which I've never been to yet we're, def we're definitely gonna go there Road, you guys. Sweet. Thanks, buddy. Thanks, buddy. All right, the snow flurries are picking up, and I can see further down Moon Ridge Road. It's picking up even there. I don't know if you guys can see it from here, but look, that hazy area. That is more snow. Watch, you'll see. We're about to drive into it. It's really cool looking. Yeah, here it is. All right, sweet. Well, just wanted to give you guys a quick update show you guys what's going on and uh as i said i'm i will do the very best i can to get to everyone that asks me to go check certain spots out i really want to do that for you guys and i'm i'm, I'm not forgetting intentionally i promise you that i love doing it so anyway guys it's march 19 2023 in big bear we're gonna shut this off right now but i love you guys and i hope you have a wonderful day and get your buns up here and have some fun take care guys